Five minutes, fellas. Five minutes. I right, appreciate it, man. Oh, okay. You getting that bed in before the boom, oh, huh? Yeah, yeah, LA all the way. <laughs> what? Oh, come on, man. You know it's Boston, baby. KG, I understand why you said it, but it's LA. Jay, are you serious? You know what? It's LA. Why are you standing up? Because it's LA. L you know what? You ain't scaring me. Let me tell you something. That ain't it's enough. Boston, Boston, Boston. It's LA. Who fans? It's your boy KG. The NBA Finals have arrived, and I'm pumped to be riding alongside the King of Sportsbook for the team versus team. When every shot counts and the stakes are sky high, you know what time it is. Time to seize the moment with BetMGM. They have a new offer, and it's heat. Exclusively for Hoop fans. Yes, Hoop fans. Sign up for an account using the code KG1500. Yes, KG1500. Then lay down your first bet. If you don't hit, no worries. BetMGM's got you covered with up to $1,500 back in bonus bets. We're talking about the NBA Finals here, where legends are made and the heart of basketball beats with the loudest. With BetMGM, you're not just watching the action, you're part of it. So lock in, get hype, pull up to NBA Finals with KG Certified and BetMGM, proud partners of the NBA. Let's get it! I'm watching Shorty. Kaylin Clark go through shit. I'm watching all. Man, rookies, you're gonna go through some shit. And guess what? When you're in, when you got the bulls out of your back, yeah. yeah, when you in, it's gonna come with some shit. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't nobody hitting y'all with the uh, uh, with the step back in the high. Yeah. It's a compliment. Yeah, you fear. It's when, a sign of listen, respect. It's a sign of respect when niggas start doing this bullshit too. When they start nipping you in, and yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm on, I'm on here. Y'all ain't just treat me like, yeah, I'm in here. I'm in the scout report. Motherfuckers is gas. Bro, you know what the biggest compliment is? Man, I used to go out to the club. We used to go out. And I used to go out on purpose to see who was out. Who was drinking? Who was doing whatever? Yeah, nigga, you better be ready tomorrow, nigga. Yeah, 48 at your ass. I, I, you hear what I'm saying? Man, you go to bed with that. You go to bed with that. As you sipping and doing whatever you doing it. Ah! Ticket over there in the corner looking crazy with a black hoodie. Might be sweating with glasses on. P like, damn, nigga, you ain't having no fun? Yeah, I'm having fun. I'm just checking out. Like, I'm like just locked in. in. I'm locked in. I'm locked guy. in. I'm locked in, bro. I might be in the corner like this watching, watching niggas like, yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm out. I'm gone. Sitting over here, Dad, he got three, four bottles. Oh, no. Hey, you can't do that and play me tomorrow. So I will walk. You hear what I'm saying? Bro, all this is gamemanship. All this go with the game. All this P, you know exactly what I'm saying. Bro, you have to come in here, bro, in the drill, old head ready on the drill. You hear me? And you're gonna have to dust the old head, or you're gonna get dusted. It is, and it ain't no great. Right, right. And that's how you get better. Get up. He's gonna help you up. Get, get it up, get up. Bro, bro, Lee used to be Tetris. Bro, it used to be a drill under the basket. Two lines. And the coach go like this. Alright, go. Roll the ball out. Remember the roll the ball out? You get the ball, niggas once right here. Nigga, it was once, three dribbles. And then they go five, That's four. old school drill. Man, huh? this drill will make you adjust to the drill. They not doing that drill. Listen to me though, this is barbaric. This is getting you to align with the league. What she is going through, that's the WNBA. The WNBA is, is physical, we're starting to see that now. It's chippy, it's always been. Man, listen, I don't know if y'all saw, uh, Angel Reese got goddamn DDT. She got hit in the head, then DDT. All these motherfuckers didn't do that. Pin it for the three, for the one, two. You f yeah. oh, that's what I'm saying, bro. All y'all part of it. But until anybody get a long ball, shut up. Ain't nobody. She's transcending the game. Today's game is what? High pacing threes. Nobody games looks like hers. And you know what is coming. Right to left, step back left. Ha. And you can't do What's shit. What's the name got that? Who? Sabrina got that. Nah, she ain't got it like this. She ain't got it like this. She ain't got the clip like this. And guess what I'm waiting on? I'm waiting on that shootout. Yeah, I want to see the Nestle, uh Caitlin Clark shootout. Yeah. Sabrina and her? Man, yeah. I actually think, I think Shorty got it. I want to see her stealth shoot, bro. Yeah. She'll yeah. Put, put her in the yeah. Hall. It should be them three shoot it off. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who else? Dame? We could throw Dame in there. Who else? Who else got a Clay? Bro, we need a crazy shoot off this shit. We need to put the girls in that motherfucker, let them two. Man, let them go. Let's see. One, one, you know what I'm saying? Two rounds. That'll go, bro. That will go. And the more and more I keep checking out these finals, and the more and more I'm nervous, man. I'm nervous. I'm nervous for the Celtics, man.
I, I don't. I, I think this is going to be a closer series than we think. I'm, 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 I'm nervous. You know what I'm saying? Because I say this, bro. So I'm looking at who's best prepared. Mm-hmm. Obviously, both teams. Celtics are hands down, arguably deep, deep, deeper. Think about the method of how um, Dallas has won. Dallas has won with three defenders being on the court with two unbelievable scores, right? Man, bro, I think Jason Tatum, this going to be his toughest, this going to be his toughest matchup, man. Uh, P.J. Washington is 6'9", strong, gritty. Yeah, I, I, I'm, not, I'm not saying he can stop him, but he's been playing he's great defense. He's got the feet to stay on And he's been, and you know what, too? The, the route in which Dallas and I came through the Clippers, Dallas and I came through they didn't, they uh, didn't, they didn't, Shea. They didn't, they didn't went through the gauntlet. They, 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 they're prepared for the Celtics as any other team coming into Like, Celtics got premier one-on-one talent that can play one-on-one, put you in those little small spaces. They got five guys you got to, you know? But, man... The Mavs have, they've been prepped to, to, to not only guard, but to, to play and beat the Celtic team. To me, if they can be consistent with what they've done in the playoffs, I'm talking about with Anthony Edwards, with, with uh, uh, Shea. I think with, this is a bad and, matchup for the Mavs. Listen, I, I don't. I don't think so. I, I, I think the Celtics are going to present a bad matchup to anybody. But more importantly, if, they, if those two, uh, okay, if those two, get into a rhythm, that's, that's, that's your concern because those two have been showing that they can go first half, second half. And neither one, and neither, and nobody has taken the ball out of their hand. Listen, well, well, the, Cel- the Celtics couldn't should... because Gobert is too big to be out there trying to guard one-on-one. Well, the Celtics are going to have to take away something. And I'm going to tell you what really I'm demoralized. Trapping, dude. Huh? I'm just going to trap him every pick and roll. I'm not trapping him. I'm going to actually make him finish at the basket. He's not going all the way. He, he goes so much, and then he's live, bro. And, and listen. So, so how you going to play the pick and roll? Pick and roll, I'm going to have to switch to pick and roll. Luca's busting everybody's ass, so guess what? It so doesn't matter. So why not trap then? Listen, if he puts the mark on the game, Pete, that's what I would do. I would actually start the game by trapping his ass, but, you know. Like that's get, a, get the ball out of his hand. And just, you know. I don't think they want this. I don't know. You know, you got all this energy got, and shit. I, I want them to throw the ball to Garland in the middle and, and Lively in he, the he, middle. He made plays, though. That's what I'm saying. When, when, when in Minnesota, when Lively and Garland grabbed the, uh, got the ball in the middle, mm-hmm. they went immediate corners and then dove. And then this guy came to the top, right? I'm cool with that. Man, man, Junior, uh, Derrick Jones Jr., he three ball. Off. He, he owned off, Listen, I got, I got that. But when he owned, n- n- you overreact. Yeah. Like, I'm, listen, this is when you got to think the game, too, bro. You got to beat me, though. Like, they got to beat Nobody's me. thinking like that. Nobody's out there thinking like this. So when you see the three go down, you go, oh, shit. And Whatever. then the coach say, you got to beat her, you know? Whatever. Whatever. No, 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 no. But you're not. Yeah. You can say that. You're, yeah. you're, you're, you're geared enough. Yeah, Nigga, yeah. these kids, these, I don't want to call them kids because they're young men. But these men, young men out here are locked in it to where, they see that as rhythm. So if Jones Jr. hit, if he hit that, he it's to, like he gonna have about ten. He gonna have ten of them. I know that, but I'm saying you can't overreact to that. Right, if exactly. He hit one or two. Exactly. Him and PJ Washington hit the corner threes. Guess what Minnesota did? Man, fuck that lob. We got to get. And then the boys, cause not a Kevin, lob, open. lob, lob, lob. They got a oh. lob every other play. Yeah. So you gotta have to take something away. And man, again, I'm going back to coaching. Jason Kidd is the best at manipulating. Uh, series like this. P, you, you've been in it with him. You saw him in the garden yourself when they was on his ass about whatever it was or his situation uh, in, in his private life, and it made him better. You was almost like, chill, chill, because the more... Man, I, I watched it, bro. They, man, they was loud with it, and he yeah. got better. Came down, lob, boom, stole it, three. He didn't even have no three. Oh, versus. Man, yeah. when he played Boston, Jason Kidd didn't even have, he wasn't even known as a three. If he had his feet set, and the day was yeah. shining, and it wasn't raining, and, and you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Man, Jay Kidd came in there, got a three, damn it was MVP of the league. Just because of what he did in Boston, bro. He I that, thought he should have got MVP. He should have, but, you know, it is what it, right, right? 
Man, he got the he got the control, man. That's what I'm watching. So now nah, he he, then he got came the control full circle as a coach. Yeah, because I'm seeing little adjustment. See, coaching right now is different. Like you, you base coaching is based off your defense. You also now. got Sweeney over there too. Let's not say that. You know he got the listen. Yeah. Y'all don't know his staff. He got Twitter man over there, and he got uh he got he got Sweet over there. Sham got too. He got he got Sham over there. So another motherfucker ain't nobody talking about. And there and uh uh there again um um what's my dog the old head over there um Dale Armstrong. Armstrong D A yeah he over there man they got an assortment of not only players ex players but knowledge Twitter man probably one of the best defenders that nobody knows about I'm talking about Jared Dudley he's sitting over there just on some maniacal and then Sweet don't ever sleep Sweet wakes up like. He's like the beer parcels of basketball. He like a baby Tibbs. Straight up. Real shit. He don't hear him daring. They, they know exactly who I'm talking they about, man. They, they don't smile. They, they got the rolls of paper. They got the, you know what I'm saying? He, that's, that's the machine Jason Kidd has over there. And yes, Pete, since we uh, was under him no, and man. him being really like a point guard still when he was coaching us. Yeah, yeah. You he, can see his development and where a he's oh, where, as a coach. I swear yeah. because... Like, I see the coaching on a defensive standpoint. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Offense is going to be the offense. Like, you got great players, they're going to make the plays. But where you see real coaching today is going to be on the defense. When I'm seeing the little adjustments he make, oh, I'm going to put, oh, you know what? We're going to run a zone. Okay, now I'm going uh, to put Luca on Gobert. We're going we gonna, to we gonna hide him over here. I'm, I'm looking at all that little shit, and I'm like, okay, I see these little adjustments that Minnesota ain't adjusting to. All right. And I'm like, okay, Jay could and came full circle Straight as a coach. He, he, he looking, he looking like he coaching like at, like he was a player now, cause he he always was playing chess as a player. Always. And, and that's what he looking like as a coach. And I, and I see it. I'm watching it, and I'm like, man, they ain't even. And, and then before Ant knew it, he had three defenders on him. He had Junior Jones Jr. on him. Green came in, and then they man. Pff, it was, right, it, right. it was going so fast you didn't even right, notice it. Right. But, man, listen, listen, I've never been ready for a finals like I am for this one. This is probably one of the most, uh, this is probably going to be one of the most uh, watched as it should be. And, uh, yeah, this is going to be much watched TV right here, man. Let's get into it, man. You know what it is? Take it the truth. Let's get it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, who was the last one to lead the league in scoring and win a chip? Was it Jordan? Was Jordan the last one? Damn, last scoring? Who won the scoring title in the chip? Who was the last one, Nate? I'm just thinking about that. Damn, they ain't been done in a Jordan? Minute. I think it's Jordan 98, but I'm gonna look it up. That's, that's, that's my That's guess. crazy, huh? That's hard to do, though. That's hard to do. To, like, nobody who, all the scoring leaders never make finals. Or never win it. It's too exhausting. And it's MVPs. It's hard for MVPs. It's hard win. for MVPs. Mm -hmm. Joker lost this year. Yeah. Shaq. Damn. Shaq in 2002, the last one to lead the league in scoring and win it all. That's crazy. That's hard to do, too. Think about three yeah. people. Shaq, Shaq in um, the year was 99-2000. Oh, yeah. Damn. So that was a great year for him. Led the league in scoring. He was MVP and then won the, won the title that year. Yeah, that was a good year. 99 was a good year. That was probably his most dominant year. That was a tough year. Yeah, that's, I mean, right in that window of, of 99 to 02 was the, the apex of, of Shaq, I want to say. Yeah. Yeah, that was a good year. That was a, that was a hard year. Yeah. I mean, Take it. One thing you, you guys brought up earlier that I wanted to bring uh, to your attention, the Celtics are holding teams to 23% on corner threes so far in the playoffs, and the Mavericks lead the playoffs in mm. shooting corner threes at 40%. So in your eyes, like kind of who wins the edge of, of that? Because Luka loves to go dish to those corners, and that's why I think they're shooting at such a high clip there. Man, this uh, – so – the fact that they are so conscious to take away the, the corner three says one thing, that not only is this part of the game plan, but this is part of who they are. They don't give up corner threes. That's, that's like one of the cardinal rules in the rule book, right? But this series is going to come down to who plays better defense. This is going to be better defense, better offense versus better defense on both sides. I feel like, like you just said, the Mavericks – have shown that they are a defensive team. We have two offensive defensive teams in the finals. Would you agree? Would you agree yeah, with that? Yeah. And whoever is able to put the defensive runs together is going to actually, for me, is going to actually show or have more opportunity to win this series. But they, it's going to have to, like I said this, 
before uh, the Minnesota uh, Mavericks uh, series. Um, Dallas is going to have to come in here and get some respect right off the bat. And you're going to have to win in Boston one time. I thought, I thought if, if, if Dallas had a chance to beat Minnesota, and they did, they was, have to go, they was going to have to come in and, and get a game in Minnesota. And they did that. It was a different series when they won in Minnesota. You feel me? Boston is super comfortable at home and, and, and really good on the road, but... They're not comfortable at home, though. They, they are, bro. They're not. Boston is not comfy at home. I, I can't say that they're more comfortable on the road. I, more you can say, you can say they are more comfortable on the road. You can say they play better. I can't, I can't speak to Warren's comfortability. I mean, like, That's think what I'm about saying. They, like, they record over the last, man, no, they record over the last three years on home in the playoffs is damn near like they only like one game over 500 or something you, like that. You steady like, talking about, what's that, regular seat? What you talking about? That's I'm talking playoffs? about in the, just playoffs. They two losses in the playoffs was both at home. They ain't lost on the road. Yeah, they're twelve and two, and yeah, it was game two of the yeah. first round of game they ain't two of lost the second that. round. They ain't, they ain't lost on the road. They got two losses at home. I'm saying Dallas gonna have to come in here and get some respect and win. Yeah, in yeah. I think that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I think Celtics got to come out and just like create some doubt. I think they got to blow them out game one. Create some Absolutely. doubt. Absolutely. Like come out and just if you, smack. Them. If you the Celtics, you gotta step on you these. You gotta establish that home court. Straight up. You gotta establish like big look dog where y'all shit. at. You see all this green, you see all these banners. Big dog shit. Uh, we 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 right here at the finish line and we crossing this year. Word. Like, that's gotta be the attitude coming Word. into game one. Like, nah. Word. Nah, homie. This ain't that. Whatever that was over there in Minnesota, right. wherever that was over in LA. Whatever that was over in Oklahoma City, that ain't over here. Right. And, and, and yeah. got to establish that. Yeah, from the get. From, from the get. From the get. From jump ball. I wouldn't dap. I ain't dapping nobody. It's cool. 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 Nah, right. real shit, because when I don't dap you, that's almost like a, it ain't a disrespect. No, we can, no game one, we can dap, but no, right after game one, we good. I ain't dapping. Now, if oh, we I'm can dap game that, one. I ain't dapping. I want you to know. I want you to feel it. All right, nigga. No, I ain't dapping. Uh-uh. <laughs> The finals. Because you know what? I don't want to be Look how me and Tiggy used to be. Look, some friendly. days I'll be off dabbing and, and he dabbing. Like, you ain't going to dab. And then, and then, and then, and then I'm not dabbing, he dabbing, nah, then he dabbing, I don't dab. Right. I got to be like, look, nah, dog. dog. I got to be in the locker room like, look, we, nah, ain't, we, we ain't dabbing today. When P say, what, like he only said about in maybe three times, four yeah, times. Yeah, yeah. But we like, be in everybody the like, hey, look, we ain't dabbing. All right, cool. We not dabbing today. What game, do you remember which game? Yeah, anything with the heat. We, it was we almost universal. We're not dapping. It was, it was almost like universal, bro. It was almost universal. When, when, when the heat shit started. We'd be like, man, we know no, like, no, nah. no, no, nothing before and, the game. And, yeah, and everybody was with it. Everybody was like, okay, cool. Bro, that's yeah. what we on. Yeah, cool. that's what we on. I'm talking about even before that, too, though. You know what I'm saying? Even yeah. before Bron, because yeah, was before D-Wade that. was, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was, yeah. Yeah. But that sends a message. That it game do, shit, it do. It do, man. Go out, man. Fuck out here. Yeah, he all excited. Hey, what's up, P? Nah, good. Good game, right. dog. Let's go. Nigga do that? Oh, no, that, that, that changed the vibration. Like, you feel it. You feel, and Nick, when a nigga lock in, when a nigga is locked in and you guarding him and you ain't on that same, you feel it. You <laughs> like, you know, oh, shit. You know what I'm thinking about that? This is totally off. But we, this is to- <laughs> when we was, I don't know what made me think of this. When we was in the Easter Conference Finals, and we play in Detroit, and you know, we about to jump ball, and I'm looking at Tick, and Rashid over here doing something. I don't know what Rashid was he on. He was playing Remember? the guitar. Remember? Yeah, he was playing the guitar. I looked at Tick, and Tick looked at me like, you see what he doing? And I swear, it flipped our switch, because it was like. Because he thought it, like, I him, him believe, doing this, like, walking around like, <laughs> like me and Tick looked at each now other look. like, like I know he ain't just like nah. like I know I don't know what yeah, it is, like, yeah, but yeah. I know it split him and it yeah. switched me. Yeah, I looked at that like oh, remember okay, that he, it was like serious. game three. But that's the way she got ready for games. You know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? But, but he didn't do it the first two games. No, he didn't do it. He didn't do that. But when he got home, he was a lot more relaxed or whatever. But yeah, I saw that. I remember. I remember. <laughs> yeah. Me and Tiggy looked at each other. Like, yeah, game three. I remember that in Detroit. And yeah. it just flicked the switch, switch. on us. Niggas went straight to demon. And then it wasn't no demon. It, 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 it was just like, it wasn't no friend. It wasn't no like no talking love. after that. Yeah, after that, it, and both sides. <laughs> both, both sides, sides yeah. Sides. And we all cool. Straight up. Real, Charles, like my Charles, brother. See, right. We all cool. Up, it was, like after that, I remember we was like, we it ain't was cool. Off. Right? It was we was off. off. Everybody. Everybody. But that's 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 part of it too, though. Yeah. That's part of it. Damn, that was I don't know what made me think of that. Who do you think I'm more depth? I think the Celtics have more better players. 
You know what I'm saying? Not necessarily like. Like when you go down the line after you knock out, if you after you take out the superstars. So if the top seven, let's say. Yeah. So like, after you knock out Luca, Kyrie, Brown, and Tatum. So then we go from there. Like who's the next best player in this series? I'm gonna say okay. So maybe Porzingis. And then after that, I'm gonna look at Dallas. Like so who Dallas got? You got Lively, Garland, P.J. Washington, uh, Jones Jr. I think. Hardaway Jr. I think Derek White, the next best player. After Porzingis. Then I think Drew, the next best player after that. I got Drew before White, but okay. Yeah, or, or, or either you. one of them. So now I got so three straight Celtics. Celtics. So five of the top seven are Celtics. I think they Celtics. got five of the top seven better players. And then after that, you can say, all right, we got Peyton Pritchard, Al Hartford, uh, 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 Hauser. You know, right. they in the rotation. Right. So I'll, I'll give them uh, it's about nine of, guys. probably like... Lively, because he got a he got a huge impact. Yeah, and or, or PJ Washington. After that, they all you could flip a coin with them. And Gafford. And Gafford, yeah. or Jones Jr. They all in the same boat to and me. Four. Yeah. Yeah. So green in there. Yeah. You know they all kind of in the same boat. So I just think we got more of the top players, more of the better players at the top. Mm. You agree, ticket? Um, I would say this. Um, I agree with Paul, but I think Dallas has like uh, specific. I think Dallas has uh, guys that are specifics for what they do. Tim Hardaway Jr., Cole St- Stone. He's not even in the rotation. I'm just talking about his, like, his ability to that shoot, crazy? right? That's crazy. Yeah. He ain't even in it, right? Uh, Lively and Gaffer and what they've been able to bring from uh, the, the big man, right? Everybody is bringing their expertise to, to the party. Now, I can't say that they're a better three-point shooter or than, than, than Pritchard or they, if I went bang for bang, but Dallas has a bunch of, like, P.J. Washington was playing defense, but he wasn't playing defense like this. He, he on some, he, he got the jury yeah, goal. Yeah, yeah, right. got, he, P.J. Washington Jr. Is, 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 is showing us another level of, well, of, everything of his better. talent. Everything looked better when you're on a winning team, Facts, too. no doubt. Like, and, we're on a losing team. He was doing a lot of good stuff on, 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 on Charlotte. On Charlotte. But he wasn't playing at this and, level. When you winning... Like, when you're on a different stage, it just look better. That's what I'm saying. So you, you know what I mean? I think the Celtics are deeper, and I agree with what you said. I think Dallas has those, almost like those 007s for certain things. They got, listen, Jones Jr. was a decent defender. He wasn't defending like this. Green, hard-nosed Australian guy, you know what I'm saying? Bro, they got some specialists there. When they come in the game, listen, listen the matchup I'm watching, P.J. Washington and uh, Tatum. I don't think Tatum's seen a 6'9". I ain't, I ain't saying PJ is a mirror image, but it ain't no bullying, big fella. It ain't none of that shit. Mm-hmm. And then right to left, he can slide with you, and he gonna contest. Man, that's the matchup, bro, for me. I want to see that matchup and who wins that match. I'm, I'm, obviously, you expect Tatum, and I'm saying to dominate that. Uh, it ain't going to be that. I think it's going to be, you know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, I think, uh, yeah, obviously, I think Boston has, just like what P said, has deeper and, and, and probably better players. We got better clothes between the Celtics and the uh, Mavs. I think against Celtics, because I think you got about four guys. You blow, P. That I'm confident you down blow, the street. P. You blow. You are blow. Uh, let me explain. You think you think those you think those four guys are better clothes than those two? I got more guys to go to on the Celtics. I'm not saying they better, but I got more. I got more options over here. You trust the draw and kick with Holiday. Ha! You trust the, the, I trust the draw and kick with White right there. You draw and I kick tr- with Porzingis. With Brown with Porzingis. I trust that. You see what I'm saying? Like, I ain't saying they, because Kyrie's proven and Luka, and, you know, they had a sh- fair share of huge game winners, but I like having all these options for these, these big shots. I, I like having more. You know what I'm saying? I, I just like having more of these men. Like, I'm... You got Robert Ory over there, and then you got uh, you got Sam Cassell over there, then you got you got Jordan sitting right there, then you got Cole right there, like everybody who can hit, like who you ain't like. Oh, if I get doubled, I got Porzingis right there, I got Derek White. Them two motherfuckers closers though. Yeah, they closers. Man, but I'm saying I think we just gotta like. Man, Luca nickname should be Kill Shot. What's that nigga in that little, what's that nigga, what's, who was uh, Will Smith in that one joint? Suicide, uh, who, y'all seen Suicide? Yeah, Kill oh, Shot. Man, Luca new name is Kill Shot. Man, stop, man. Man, the Mavs got the, the two best closers. On they side? On they side. But 
I kind of agree with you in saying that Celtics probably. I can't even say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. You know what it's I'm hard saying? not to see it because I've not like, seen them do like, it. Right? God damn, damn, damn. Yeah. God damn, Holiday with the big oh, shot. Shit, Derek White. Yeah. Oh, Derek, damn. Damn. Yeah. Damn, Tatum. Damn, yeah. Tatum. Right. Man, Brown, Brown, we just didn't see Brown. Yeah. Dead that's, shot. Dead shot. Dead shot. That's his name. Yeah. Yeah. But this is kill shot. <laughs> see, so well, like, we got like, dead shot and kill shot. You can pick either one. You feel me? And Kai, man, Kyrie coming. Listen, that's so what I'm saying. Listen, I want to see the energy and how to, because his vibration has been able to be steady in this. You know what I'm saying? It ain't been hiding. He ain't really, you know, and then he looks really, really calm. You know what I'm saying? Like this energy and this environment is going to test all that. So I want to see how he plays in it. I want to see if it activates. I thought Anthony Ed was, you know, challenging or saying however, whoever I think got actually in a, activated him, right? I want to see if, he, if he's still activated in this series. But yeah. man, I, I would say, uh, I would argue that. that that's, a, that's a good point. Yeah. But I, I would say, I, I would go with the Mavs in having more polished finishers. Like, like, yeah. Like, when it comes down to it, I'm expecting Luka. Yeah, he not showed it. So, yeah, I would say the Mavs got the better of the closers out of the two teams. Oh, that's fair. Now, that's solid what you yeah, said, no, too, though. Cause, you know what I'm saying? Because the draw are kicking in Indiana. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, damn. The brown in the corner to, in the to corner. get in the overtime. Right, right, like, damn. right, right. You can't even like, see God, that shit. Damn. Yeah. Like, that's clutch. Yeah, it is. And the seed's growing up in front of us, bro. Yeah. It's time for graduation. But this is going to be a tough-ass series for them, bro. Everybody got the seeds win. I don't, I don't think it's going to be a cakewalk like everybody think it is. We was looking at the development of both sides. You got Sham Guard, you got Sweeney, you got uh, uh, Tyson Chandler working with Lively and Gafford and all those guys. And then on the Celtic side, you got Sam Cassell, you got, you know, uh, you know, Joe and all those guys developing those guys. Church asked me who had the better of the development side. And I said, I actually thought that both sides had equal quality developers. Sam Cassell has developed some of the premium point guards, young premium point guards in our league, from Maxie to John Wall to Bill. I mean, you got three head coaches on the Celtics side. Facts. Real shit. Real you, you shit. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that. I feel like that. Well, I mean, the Mavericks, when it comes to development, they got, they got a strong development no, they do. team of guys over there. No, they that's, do. That's what, that, that's what I was talking about. That's why they both in the finals. That's the real shit. And it's all the culmination of those development and all that stuff coming together to where we at now. You seen the Clippers series coming out? I saw the commercial. I, 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 got, I got to check that out. You excited about watching something like that? Hell yeah. Hey, I got to see what Doc was on. Right. <laughs> Behind the scenes. I know Doc had his fingerprints on all that. He wasn't having it. I know Doc wasn't having it. I hope this don't get clipped like the last jump. I want, this, I want to watch all 10 of these. I don't want to... Yeah, oh, I, I, I like. I, I can't wait. I'm about to go home and watch this. Yeah, me too. I'm, I'm excited to watch the Clipper joint. Um, I think it's, it's great. It's called TV. Clipped. Yeah. Yeah, and I could have watched it this morning. Yeah, I me saw too. It. I saw it. Yeah. I was like, it was prime I'm right away. there. I'm away. Yeah, it was right there. Yeah, and then I was like, I'm gonna say this, but uh, yeah, TV's dead, so it's good to have something like this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm gonna check that out. They got Lawrence Fishburne playing Doc. Nah, I know <laughs> that's gonna be good. That's gonna be good. That's gonna be good. <laughs> Yeah, that should be fun. Yeah, that should gonna be good. Curious to get your guys' opinion on this. Uh, Jamal shot this yesterday. He said, if Dallas wins this series, I think the championship will mean more to Kyrie than the one he got in Cleveland. Ooh. You agree with that or you feel different? If Dallas wins this series, Luka is king of the world. But what about for Kyrie? Because it'd no, be no, a no. second chip. It, it, it not only uh, gives Kyrie a, a, um, a new light, but it takes him out of the old and you know what I'm saying? Like, it definitely means a, a lot more. I think he's, uh, since he left Cleveland, he's been on this journey and yeah, it's brought him here. Um, they win this, I think if the Mavs win this, not only is uh, it kind of sees or we, we kind of put uh, Kyrie in another conversation in which he belongs, um, but it it's also activates Luka now. Luka, when he was young, won in his league that he was in. You know what I'm saying? He won. Early, youngest to win your league. That's what I'm MVP. saying, bro. That that's not by coincidence. Yeah. So he's carrying that here. If he's able to, can you imagine going to the goddamn Olympics, winning an NBA championship, bro? That's gonna be super lit. It's gonna be Lucas Summer. We always say if Kyrie wins his second championship, this will mean more than the first. Is that what he said? That's what Maul said yesterday. Yep. 
It's not like I that. see what he kind of saying, but that first one, the way he got it, is going to be tough to top. And the, the, the shot, but I will say this. If Kyrie wins his second, we're going to have to erase somebody out of the top 75. Like, we're going to have to reevaluate this Olympic team this summer. Like, man, this like... Kyrie so, in the top 75? No. no. Kyrie was not in the top 75? No. No. Like... Get the fuck out of here. That's what I'm saying. Some no, stuff no, no, going to no, have to no, be no, no. rewritten. Whoa, 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 whoa. Kyrie, is, Kyrie not, is not in the top 75? Kyrie is not in the top 75. I don't honor that. I can't honor that. I can't honor that. You not, see what I'm, I'm saying? I'm just respect. I'm just, I'm just respect. When I'm Res- looking at the guys respect. in the room. No, 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 no. He, he's he, definitely he what? in there. He definitely in there. Like, I'm just saying. Like, I don't know who, oh, you know, no, but he, he yeah. definitely yeah, got to get Yeah, it. Kai's in that. He's on the list. He's in the conversation, bro. He's, listen, when but I talk. it's going to be hard. It's hard. You know, they came back from 3-1, then the shot, and then the, how his... Yeah, that was tough. Just how he played in that yeah. series, because I saw I was at every game. That's crazy. Live. That, that was going to be tough to beat. That was some unbelievable basketball he played in that series, too. Man, it, he could have easily got MVP. <sighs> man, that that's going to <sighs> Man, the Mavs win this motherfucker? That's going to shake the league, boy. That'll that's, shake the league. That's going to shake the league. Either one going to shake the league. I, it don't matter, because they're both first-timers. I, mean, I get that, but we kind of we kind of looking at the Celtics like this is a Celtic window right here. If the Seas win yeah. this, the Seas to me, and I'm you know you got injury and nobody ever talks about that short window. We saw we saw Denver get smacked with that short window, and then Denver didn't get to bring back that same team either. Right. You didn't have Brown, you didn't have Uncle Jeff, you didn't have none of those pieces. Right. Feel me? And and, and you know. So when you get that shortened season, you got to bring that team back. If if you're gonna add some, add something better. But man, yeah, I think. Uh, but this is this is Boston's window to me. Yeah, me too. I agree. This is their window. They can run like two, three. You know, I'll, you know, it's so hard to get there and shit. But, but if they get this first one, they can have a, a possible dynasty. No doubt. No doubt. This is their window right here. This is when it, this is when Jason Tatum and Jay Brown start to separate themselves with yeah. this shit right here. You know right. what I'm saying? You took your lumps against Golden State. You learned in that series. Now you got to apply it to this one. Like, listen, man, when you're in the fraternity, man, you understand uh, the bylaws, you understand the mentality. You know, I didn't see any of those guys grab the ball when they won the Eastern Conference Finals. They wasn't really who Ryan. That ain't, that ain't really Celtic, that ain't really Celtic culture there. You know, you, you, the Eastern Conference is the path. You got to go through the path, but you don't celebrate until you hoist the Larry O'Brien. And that's just law. So, you know, anybody that's coming into this organization, you're going to know the history. You're going to know the ones that come before you, and you're going to know what your, what your, each time you put on a jersey, practice, something, you do something for the Celtics, it's going to be on professional, it's going to be on championship level, and it's going to be quality. And that's, that's kind of the makeup and the DNA of that they, you know, so chasing 18, don't matter who comes through that door, you're going to know that we're chasing 18. Get 18, boom, we're chasing 19. Like, that's, that, that's, that's, that's all they've been, that's all they preach. That's all they go, that you're going to ever hear in there. It's the culture. It's a winning culture, and it's a championship culture. It ain't that what if, and ain't that can't wait. We, nah, the ceiling is always to Larry O'Brien. It ain't nothing else. I uh, want to step outside the series for a second. There's some reports going around with the 76ers wanting a max player from a pool. It includes LeBron, PG, Jimmy Butler, Ingram. Kind of curious who you think the best player that Embiid and Maxi should get paired along with them. They have a lot of cap room. So who's that guy, in your guys' opinion, that would set them over the top? Who's, the, who's, the, who's available? You got George. I want to see KD go back east, man. I don't like KD out west. He ain't under contract, though. Fuck all that. They, they finna move all that, yo. Phoenix got to figure that out. I don't, I don't think he looks all happy, and this is the time to do all that shit. Everybody's up in the air talking. Everybody want to change shit. This is when you start doing it. What? KD to move? KD to Philly? Ooh, that's heat. That would be crazy. That's see, that'll heat. be crazy seeing KD third option, though. No, he ain't no third option. Then ain't no option. Second option. Man, bro. Man, you I get, mean, B is the first option. <laughs> right, you get to big fella. And then pick and roll, you let young fella go off. But then shit, when y'all two ain't doing I mean, I think he at the age where he could just be just that's who the, he I is, the sniper. What, I think that's what I'm saying. The sniper. I think that's the reason he went to Phoenix, so that somebody can draw the kick to him and he can buy. Yeah. Man, they still the, giving it to him, saying, hey, man, save us. Right. Hey, that, man, that, hey, that, here, that give action, it to K. Yeah. Like him over there, third option will be perfect. He'll play to about 40, 46. 47. I was about to say. <laughs> <laughs> 
man, spot up and shoot. That's all he want to do. Yeah, man, Lord, I don't think he, he'll cook you. But Lord, that you know. That will shake up the East. That'll shake up everything. That'll shake it. Ooh, the East need a rattling too, bro. I don't think, like, I'm listening to the players, like, Bron ain't going nowhere. No, Bron going to fuck up Maxie's game. Any point guard, Bron come over there, bro. Yeah. He dominate the ball too much. Maybe Paul George. Yeah, that's yeah, that, that's the next big free agent. That's and, a, that's, and then Siakam and OG are two other free agents that are that I are pretty Siakam good players. I think Siakam found a home in Indiana. Yeah, he got it. Siakam should stay there. That's a good fit for him. They look good too. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah. So I think maybe the best thing is George. I like P over there too. P G. Malik Monk, our uh, our cracking yeah, player. I like, He's I, like, a I, like free Malik, I like Malik Monk, but I'm, I like I'm trying to see. I like him in his role. Yeah. 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 And I like Maybe him you know. in. I like him in uh, sack though. I thought he he had some good continuity with uh Fox and uh, some yeah. bonus day. I like that I young mean, he team. He thrived over there. Yeah. I, I want KD back in the East though, man. I, I would love to see KD in in New York. I'm gonna be. I want KD to go to the Knicks. I want to see the Knicks that would be cracking. Crazy. I want to be crazy. Nigga, the, man, listen, y'all, y'all heard me. Y'all, heard, y'all know what I say. Man, New York lit. It's all lit. That would be crazy. I'm telling you. They need a, listen, it's going to be lit anyway, dog. Next year going to be a whole new fold. Yeah. Real shit. Let's get some fan questions. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, first question Hold up. On. First off, I got everybody and their mama sending me in my inbox. Stop sending me trick shots. Hey, look, send that shit to certified, not the tick pics, okay? Send it to KG certified. I got a thousand motherfuckers now jumping off of houses, off the barn. Damn, for missing real. Missing this shit like. like so I, I got to send my trick shots to you. No, to, bro. Send it to, send 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 it it to, to church and KG certified. Everybody now, right. I got grandmas out here throwing. Oh, man, I started just... I man, threw I a even... shot from the bottom of the street. <laughs> it bounced off the car on the roof, then went in. I got... You get it? Yeah, I got to edit it, though. See? <laughs> <laughs> All right, first question. <laughs> what defense adjustments do the C's need to make to neutralize the, the inside lob to the bigs? So we see Gafford and Lively getting a lot of those drop-offs from Luca. How would the defense uh, neutralize that? I think the defense neutralized that by switching. For one, the Celtics got more than Minnesota. They got more versatile defenders. So if I got Jason Tatum guarding Garland, or I got Brown guarding uh, Gap- Lively, or Gap- or, 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 Gap- or Gap- Gafford, Gap- Gafford. Gafford, yeah, Gafford. Called nigga Garland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do so the same G- shit. Gafford, he's gonna be the center, and I think even Porzingis, you, you switch him out on. On Luka Doncic. The problem is, though, P, when we go pick and roll at the free throw line and I open up, I'm lobbed. Corner man got to cover me. This oh, guy that's on the back, got to, he got to, he got to X out. Drop. He, oh, Lord. X out, yeah, yeah. The nigga that's in the pick and roll shit, as soon as we switch, I'm turning, I'm sprinting to the corner. I ain't even, I, I, it ain't, I ain't even in the play no more. Because the nigga that's right here that's guarding the guy in the corner, he got to pull early. If I don't, listen, coming out the pick and roll, if I ain't hearing you as you come out the pick and roll, you're dunked. These niggas, they Tyson Chandler. Yes. Lord, if it's, a, if, if, it's a, if it's a jump ball, and guess what Luka and, and, and Kyle putting it? Above the square. Man, Gafford and Lobby are going to get, man, they're going to get in two hands at that. that. Or you trap every pick and roll. Nah, and bro, you're going to have to, listen, you're going to have to trap higher because the lower you get, you're getting closer to the basket. Yeah. So, listen, I, man, I would, I would throw a zone on this shit, bro. I would throw a zone, switch the tops. He, yeah. he, he, the big's going to have to roll into another big, right. and that's how you kill that, bro. Right. Minnesota took nothing away. Me, took myself, away. man, make, man, let's see if Luka can make a right-hand layup. Right there at the basket. Right. You know, you know what he did? He had the ball in the rim and just threw it to Gaff, uh, uh, big fella. He caught it. He ain't finished not one time. And guess yeah. what? Lolly is 14 for 14. In the last series, he <laughs> shot 100%. <laughs> Motherfuckers. That and it was, was all lobs. All lobs. Man, one time Kyrie threw that motherfucker like some off his elbow or some shit. He caught that motherfucker. Boom. Okay? Man, they, man, listen, right. you want to stop this shit, bro, you're going to have to stop that because that's a big part of their energy. And when they get fueled from that, they turn back around and they turn into dogs. Yeah. Their offense actually fuels their defense, bro. Straight up. Next question comes from Lamar. What's the most interesting matchup of the finals? Jason Tatum, P.J. Washington, bro. Uh, Luca, uh, Holiday. Luca, Holiday, White, Irving. I think... I think- Whoever's guarding Kyrie. White. 
that's gonna be that's gonna be one to watch. Man, I, White or, uh, or who Drew? would you put on? Who would you put on Kyrie? Drew. You put Drew. Who you gonna put on Luca? Brown. No, you're exhausting your you're exhausting office now. I mean, they're gonna run pick anyway. And we're gonna switch stuff anyway. Man, I got two guards that are yeah. built for defending. I'm gonna put Derek White on Kai, and I'm gonna put um, uh, Holiday on uh, Luca. And let's get it. Shake that motherfucker. And let's go. Let's yeah. go. Watch this. Ha. All that, they gonna switch all that shit. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Man, listen, I'm, I'm ready to see this energy between Porzingis and uh, Luca. I'm ready to see this energy. Cause yeah. there's some energy yeah. there. We not even, I don't hear nobody talking about it. They're trying to, no, on certified, we gassing. What's up? What's up, big fella? I heard you talking all that shit. What's up? Yeah. 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 Bitch ass nigga. Yeah. Yeah, I left you. Yeah. Yeah, we ain't want you. You heard? Lord, it's finna be some bullshit out right, here. Right, right. Lord, what? You ain't even like that. Bro, and then you gotta know the walkthrough. They know each other game. So Luca, he go, come over here. He go, I'm my Porzingis in there, probably right? yeah. telling everything. Right. <laughs> right, right. And then Porzingis probably over there, like, yeah. I mean, Luca probably over there, like, yeah, let's get his ass in pick and rolls. I'm gonna mm -hmm. do his ass just like I did Rudy. We're right. Gonna, he know, he know it. I'm gonna cook his money. Bro, it's gonna be some real shit talking in this. It's gonna be some. It's, it, I, I am anticipating the physical finals too, bro. Uh, they gonna have a problem matching up with Porzingis is the X factor, I think, in all of this though. You think so? Man, he punishes the switch. He punishes the switch. He, he like if you put if you get Kyrie on Porzingis at the free throw line. You start him? Yeah, I'm starting him. You starting him? I'm starting him. Listen, man, uh, I would not start Porzingis. I would have Al come off the bench. I mean, I'll, have, I'll start out and have him come off the bench. Let him uh, straight up. And then I, you let him finish the game? He finishing the game? You, you match him up with a lively, you, you saying? I want, so I think, I think you start with a presence first. I, was, I, was, I would actually start uh, Al to create some physicality because lively and Gaffer are, ro are rolling with intent. Yeah. Listen, if you ain't at the rim, man, they throwing your ass in, boy. You hear me? Straight up. Uh, I would start like that, and then Porzingis ain't been in no series. Yeah, bro, this, bro, listen, bro, we hit the, we hit the tunnel, and you hit the, yeah. you see that big ass? Oh man, it, it's it, uh, no other series is matched to this. Yeah, I can't. Even, I think they putting oxygen in the joint because when you come in, dog, I told you, you nose in your shit, and you. And you just, oh shit, what? I mean, I'm, am I lying? Am I lying? He laughed at me. No. Boy. He said they put oxygen Lord, in the joint. Lord, they putting oxygen in the joint. Boy, you hit the, you hit the tunnel. I take it be having all kind of conspiracy theories going on. Do you ever hear him? Do you ever hear me when I say something? Do you ever hear him stop me? No, I don't, because right. it's something to it. I, I, right. I, I, he, he I mean, in the line. It's too many, <laughs> it's too many times he just says, he, he, no he, he know right. what's going on. <laughs> I can't even deny it. You in a demon mode. That's the only thing I can describe it. Because you don't hear nothing, you don't see nothing, and you're in demon mode. You will literally run through a brick wall <laughs> head first and be feel nothing. I'm telling you, you, Lord, when you hit the tunnel, you feel like you're 100%. Yeah. Your knee hurt, ankle, toe, forgot about the elbow, your neck, oh, you forgot about all that. I'm mm -hmm. telling you. When you hit that tunnel, yeah. Hit the tunnel, boy. Perform. What's wrong with you, man? So man, it's just so much energy, I don't know what to do with it. Like, man, you hear me? <laughs> Straight up. Man, this is gonna be fucking electric. This is gonna be, a, this this gonna be, be electric. Listen, don't call wait. me. Phone's on airplane mode. I'm in the. Hey, look. I ain't got no tickets. Damn, how we ain't got no tickets? I ain't got no tickets. No, people asking. I ain't got no, <laughs> I ain't got no tickets. <laughs> uh, next question Is this even Lucas Prime? We see how good he is since the start of his career. He's 25%. That's 25% his prime. Because you got to stay been playing pro since 16. Right now, he's 25. He's in the middle of his prime. Right now. Now, it's about how long his prime is going to last. Yeah, he's in his prime. Shit, shit, yeah. He's been playing pro 16. He in the middle of his prime. Come on, now he's five first team all NBAs. He made first team since second year in the league. So when he hit the league, he hit the league in his prime. Hit the league in the stride, eh? He hit the league in his prime. Damn. 
He came in and averaged like 28 out the yeah, jump. That's, yeah, that's unheard of. Second season, yeah, 28 a game. Listen, yeah, he came in the league in his prime. Listen, Luca is set up to be the only nigga to catch Bron. Don't nobody want to say that shit. For scoring? Listen, Luca is averaging 30. What did he average this year? 33? 34. Come on, man. Almost yeah, 34. 35. On one leg, drinking beer, having fun, doing really? God knows what else. Right. You see Mike Finley take the beer from him? Yeah. Lord, the first thing I thought is this. Man, bro, if Phil Jackson would have came and took, took a beer from Dennis Rodman. Dennis Rodman would have snatched it back. Man, Dennis Rodman would have got another beer and popped it open and finished the conversation. Right. Is it a man's league? Absolutely. They grown. Let him enjoy that. You sitting there chilling. Mike Finley come take the fucking beer out your head. Nah. Assistant GM. No, nah, I'd be like, watch out, dog. <laughs> <laughs> watch out, dog. <laughs> you want me to resign? Watch out, dog. No, nah, we getting ready for the we getting ready for the nah, final. No, watch out, dog. All right, we get we'll, we getting ready for the final. All right, I'll get ready tomorrow. Tonight I'm cracking. Let me get the bill. Nah, dog. As a matter of fact, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Did it, did it, did it. <laughs> Assistant GM Michael Finley fired Fire. from the Mavs for apparently <laughs> alcohol. <laughs> Lord, he trying to take the beer from, from, the, from the star player of the team. Oh my God! From watch out, dog! Watch out, dog! Hey, watch out, dog! <laughs> watch out, dog! I'm chilling. My that. dad no, right we... here. I'm talking. Right. Like, what you doing? Right. I watch out, dog. Me and my dad having one. Hey, what's like, going what's on? on what you what doing? You on some old school. I don't know what you on. Chill out, man. You doing too much. Play in the background like you do. Luca, Luca played it. I thought he, I thought he played it well. He, ain't, you know, he. Don't, listen, this is what I'm trying to tell you. He's, that's why I don't think he's in his prime yet. Lord, he's in the middle of his prime. Bro. I think he, I think he's still growing. I think Luca got another level to him, P. This is that level. No, P. He I, can play at this level for like another ten years. No, nah, I think, I think he got another level. I think he gonna, he gonna tap on if, if niggas is hitting seventy and shit, and they gonna fuck around and tap. Watch if, if Joel and B damn near had could have had eighty this year, right? If Joel and B had seventy one, Luca going man, Luca gonna give us a crazy seventy something at some point. He got another level in him, bro. That's what I'm saying. I don't, I don't, I think we ascending. I mean, the other level is winning chips. Yeah. Like, I mean, he's yep. in his prime. I mean, come on, he's well, in his definition prime. Definition of prime. Like, prime is like, I'm, I'm at the height of my superpowers right now. No, nah, this ain't that. No. At 25? Hell no. He ain't at the height of his superpowers? Like, what no. he doing? He done had an 80 Man, point he, game damn Luke near this e, year. Yeah, he Luke was a 73 e. this Luke year. E. He's 25. He Think about when you was 25. He averaged 35. Think about you 25 and then you at 30. What was what was the difference? What I mean, you knew. The only thing he gonna do what is he gonna knew. get smarter. What you knew. He gonna get smarter. That's what I'm saying. He ain't so gonna he, get more, unless he get more athletic. Who's dude. a better score? Unless all of a sudden. 25 year old P or 30 year old P? 25. I, knew I was, I, I was <laughs> more athletic. I, 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 more athletic? What the fuck does that mean? Uh, I can score a different nah, way. You just can You can get hurt and not be hurt the next day. That's the, the young mm. shit. Scoring is about how. I think that you was a better score when you got older versus when you was younger. Yeah, you was can go smarter. in there and dunk them all. I was smarter. I was definitely right, smarter. That's what I'm saying, bro. The game slowed down. 30 was sure. the 07, 08 year. You were 30 that year. Yeah, right. That yeah. nigga. And what happened? Right. That nigga. Say it again, Nate. It did two years before that, that motherfucker was another problem when he was in MVP talks. You understand what I'm saying? Like, bro, he, and that's when he was 28. 27, he was, he was killing off. You know what I'm saying? Like, P at 25, bro, and I seen you your whole life. And I seen you before we went to college. Seen you in high school, seen you before you went I mean, to college. I mean, this is got different. Some people just start their prime earlier than others. I'm just using you as an example as watching somebody ascend and watch them get better as they get better. I watched you on the one-on-one -on -one when I first came in, and you was the size of church. You was a little fat motherfucker. You had a little jury curl dripping. Man, I ain't never and you been shaking your size. shit. You were like full I force. I never been You was playing with You said full force. <laughs> Oh my God! He was either playing ones, 
And I was watching him in the corner. He didn't know I was in the gym. Hey, he rocked the nigga. Y'all got to put a picture hey, of Full listen, Force up because people don't know listen, who that is. Go look up Full Force. P had that Full Force. Oh, he had the little curl no. in his eye. Hell so he had no. to shake his shit to get it out of his eye. He so he was he rocking lied. the nigga. He was rocking the nigga, lied, rocking the nigga. Lord. <laughs> he rocked the nigga, then dumped that mother. I was like, damn, that little fat motherfucking jump. God damn, oh who is that? Oh my God. That's he got me was like, yeah, that's Paul Pierce. Yeah, that's Paul Pierce. Oh my God. That's Inglewood. That's yeah, funny. Yeah. I saw him go. That's I saw that guy full go to Kansas <laughs> and rock the Dream Team too, right? Then get to the league and then become a whole animal. You know what I'm saying? Oh, like, man. I watched that. Bro, then I then I get then I team up with you at 30 when we official. Damn, and could I, you imagine? Look at Brown and Tatum, 25, 26. Now, if we had a team though, 25, 26, that'd have been crazy. That'd have been crazy. I probably been in Dubai somewhere. Damn, that'd have been crazy. We probably been like some, we probably been immortal. Fuck. My mama. 25? That'd, that'd have been crazy. Oh, man. <sighs> Kept 25 year old KG, boy. <sighs> Ooh, God that's damn. That's not got muscles. Was this the hair you're talking about? Come on, dog. That ain't the full force. <laughs> that, ain't, that ain't it. That's him transitioning out of that. But that oh, was like the later stages dude. of that. It's some earlier shit that he wasn't. Nah, he, he got the whole full. I'm telling you, he was I, rocking I, the nigga I, in the I, gym. The he was playing one. It's the Jodeci, dog. The Jodeci? It's the Jodeci. Yeah, but it's you, the it's the it's the it's the it's the uh, minister society. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You was more Kane. Boy, you was more, more MC8. You was more MC8. Nah, I was more Kane. You was more Devante. You know I was what I'm more saying? Kane. You I was more you Kane. Wanted, nah, you was more Devante. Your little shit was in your eye. You used nah, to, hell no. Nah. He used to have to shake his shit like, yeah, nigga, check. Nah, I didn't have. Nah, I didn't have, nah, have no ice cube, girl. Nah, I didn't have no. <laughs> That Ice Cube Easy E curl? No, I didn't have that one, dog. Uh, I didn't say you did. You had the little... Uh, uh, when I saw Steph's shit, I saw your shit. I was like, oh, okay. I, I see what they... Okay. They got the little... Okay. Cool. Got the whole activated, the whole... Oh, damn. Yeah, real That's shit. Funny. First time I seen P hooping, boy. He was in Inglewood damn. Gym. Had a body like church. A little 400 pound That's little crazy. motherfucker. A little fat That's motherfucker. Crazy. That's had an over and had some ups. I was like, damn, I'm a fat crazy. motherfucking jump. Who's the oh, big guy? That's wild. That's crazy. That's crazy. All right, let's do some bad MGM picks. Let's get some fucking... Let's get some bad oh, MGM that's wild. Picks of the week. Let's get it. That's All right, wild. with the finals approaching, I, I, I figured we should do some cool prop Man, guys. we should pay up. Shit, we at the finals. Eight bottles of wine. It's 9-7. I mean, it's like, tied up. Eight bottles of bottles of beer so on the wall. I, I, I got eight <laughs> bottles too, then. Eight bottles of beer on the wall. Damn, can we get a... Damn, can, can I, I get paid up? Damn. Man, what are we doing, Damn. man? Damn, man, we gotta get some structure to this, man. Something, something, we gotta it's get set up, up, man. I, I Damn, mean, it's I, like four months. I ain't got nothing. I, I ain't got no man. Stella. I ain't got no Menage. Yeah. That's why I ain't it's got no. It's tie up. It's nice ain't got seven. Got La wow. Last week, last week, game five, you had uh, Minnesota and he had Dallas. Just saying though. But here, here's some cool prop bets. Yeah, uh, help him out, Jim. Nate. Help him out with the props. Shit. I mean, these are for both of you. Will Luca score thirty in every game? Plus nine hundred odds. Damn. Nope. Nah. No. So you're saying no? I'm saying hell no. Man, Luca Every did game. If they say no. Nah. Man, Luca finna. Man, I'm gonna take that. Give me that. Nah, Every nah, game? Hell no. Nah, hell Every nah. game of the series. He won't, I don't even think he's getting it in game one. Now he gonna get 30. They're gonna dude. establish something game one, so he's gonna be shocked and then he make the You know what? Awesome. That's hard to say. Every game? That's yeah, hard. That's, uh, that's why it's plus 900 odds. Now, that was Shay, I would take this bet, because that nigga get 30 just. Bumping. You can count it. Yeah, he gonna you get 30. You can count 30. on his that's 30. 30, win or lose. He gonna win get or lose 30. 30. 30. I'm like, oh, Shay got 15. I don't know if he's gonna get it. Next not thing you know, next 30. 33. <laughs> I'm like, damn. No, nah, not every game. That's tough. Okay, so you both know on that one. Man, I hope, I hope not. Shit. All right, next one. Tatum. Ooh, will he score 25 game? in every game? Tatum. I'll bet that. Nah. Plus 300. I'll bet that. I don't think he's gonna be aggressive. Yep. No, I don't think that. That's 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 that's, that's hard. If he averages 25, if he Damn. if he gets 25 every game, then he should be the finals MVP. Because you're dominant. 20 favorite, he the favorite. I mean, it's like four favorites. No, he's the favorite. The favorite to what? We're in finals MVP. Minus 120 is where he's at right now. Yeah, who's your finals MVP? If we take it, if we just pull it, you know what I mean? I think Brown gets finals MVP. Brown? Yeah. Brown? Brown. Over Tatum? I think Brown. No, that's a Tatum year. That's a Tatum year. If, 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 if
Yeah, if and when the uh, Celtics win this, uh, I think, I think um, yeah, the MVP is going to go to Tatum. And I think that if the Dallas Mavericks win, Luka wins it. Yeah, I think Luka wins it for we, sure. And we start the era of Luka. Straight up. Luka going to... Bro, whoever wins, whoever wins this finals mm -hmm. goes into the Olympics as a king of the hill. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, you're going to go into the so. Olympics with a whole new gloss on you. You feel me? Thursday, <laughs> Thursday. Game one of the NBA finals. We game got the Mavericks one. at Celtics. Got the Mavericks at the Celtics. Who you taking game one, P? I got Celtics by easy, lopsided win. Really? They blew them out first game? Yeah, at least by 12, 14. Really? Yep. The line's six and a half for the Celtics. Yeah, I know. 12, 14, double digit win. Man, that's tough. Yeah, I got the first game going to the Celtics. I think it's important for them to establish, uh, you know, establish something very early on. Uh, I don't see it being a blowout though. I think this is going. This I think this going to be a. Yeah, I think this is going to be a tight series. I'm anticipating the defense really being, and then I think they're going to let them play too. P. I think this is going to be a more physical finals than we've seen in the past. Yeah, I'm going to go Celtics first game too. Sunday. Sunday! Seized by 15. Hold on, we got the Mavs at the Celtics again. Who you got game two? I'm in the building. Seized by 15. Ooh. That energy, when I, come, when I come in the building. Come on now. That's going to get somebody kicked out the game right there. That's too aggressive. <laughs> you know what? Game two, man. Ah. I'm, I'm going to say the Mavs going to tie this Ooh. up. Ooh. Yeah, I think yeah, that's I think, a tricky one, too. Game listen, two so tricky. Game two so tricky, but game one is really a, a, a download to, okay, let me, let me, let me fill it out. Let me, you know what I'm saying? And if game we two, win game two, we're going to sweep them. Yeah. That would be crazy. They better win. That would be crazy. But I think in order for the Mavs to win this series, they're going to have to win in Boston at least one time and show that at some point. So, yeah, I'm going to take game two to Mavs even though I got the Celtics for this whole series. But those are the picks of the week. Let's get it.